Hello. I'm in. So this is the main corridor. Um, we've got a lot of offices down here. So we've got clinical scientists, medics, a whole host of different people in these offices. But through here is the main lab. So this is specimen reception. So here we get a lot of the samples coming through. So all over the hospital uh, have pod systems. So they can shoot any samples that uh, they want to send to us down to the pod. Um, so they'll have pods like this, they put the samples in and it comes through the air pod system uh, all through the hospital. We've also over here got the hatch. So people also drop a lot of different samples off here um, and then over here is the main sorting area. So here samples will get sorted into whether they're for blood sciences, microbiology, uh, cell path which are on the floors above us. And then all of these people here are booking in and sorting samples out. So they're booking them in for whatever blood sciences tests that they need. So there's three departments down here in blood sciences. We've got immunology, haematology and biochemistry. So they'll book them in for the tests and make sure they're going to the right department. So over here is the main biochemistry section. So this is where the bulk of the tests get processed. Um, so a lot of the samples will go in here um, and they all have a barcode on. And the barcode gets read and that tells them where they need to go and what they need to do and what tests they need doing on the main track. It'll get read here and then it'll go along and go to where it needs to go. We'll go this way. So, first of all, a lot of the samples will get centrifuged in these machines here. And then they'll get the lid taken off them. And then it'll go to one of the analyzers. So, different analyzers do different tests. Um, and the track will take the sample to whichever analyzer it needs to do the correct test. Some samples might need to go to multiple analyzers, and the track will do that. It will take them to the different analyzers. And then, when the results have been done, um, they'll come to this desk here where they'll get technically validated by one of the biomedical scientists. So over here you've got haematology. So this is where you'll do things like your full blood count, your clotting screens, uh, blood films, a lot of things like that. So that's over in this section. So these analyzers here are a bit more manual and they're part of biochemistry as well. Um, so they run things like haemoglobin A1c, which is used for diagnosis and monitoring of diabetes. And also um, it does the protein electrophoresis um, and things like that. And this section over here is immunology. A variety of different samples. Um, there's two, um, two uh, cover cells in total and a variety of different samples to specify uh, what needs to be run. And we do regular checks uh, each day to ensure that these tests are run correctly and um, efficiently. As you can see here, we have 320 wells in total, which means that at any one time we can have 320 samples running. So uh, this sample would run along and um, this um, one of our pipettes would move around, pick it up and then inject it into the well and then it will go around to the corresponding, um, corresponding sections, mix it up at the back and then test it via uh, infrafluorescence. So we shine a light through it and measure the absorbance taken from it and that's what the chemistry analysis would do. So over here we have got um, sort of round the edges away from the main analysis we've got a lot of manual tests that we run. So here we've got one of our uh, uresis machines. Um, these also might be in some places on the wards as well because this is a point of care tester machine but we do do it in the lab as well. Here we've got uh, the sweat test machines. So we measure sweat chloride and sweat conductivity. Um, and we do that to diagnose cystic fibrosis. Here we've got an osmometer. So this is using serum and urine osmolality. Um, they can both be measured using this machine here. 
here we've got a blood gas machine. Um, these are also in place around the hospital. This is another point of care testing machine, but we also have one in the lab. So if someone around the hospital doesn't have a blood gas machine near them, they can bring their blood gas samples here for analysis. And here's another standalone analyzer. So this runs some of the things that aren't on the main tracked machines. So um, we run anti-pro BMP on here, um, which is a marker of heart failure. And we also do things like IGF-1 um, and HCG, um, so they're done on this analyzer. Thank you very much for coming to have a look around Biochemistry in the Blood Sciences Lab today and hopefully we'll see you soon.